live from Atlanta Stadium in Atlanta, Georgia, the Ms. Lou Television Network brings you the ninth annual Peach Bowl Football Classic featuring the University of North Carolina Tar Heels against the University of Kentucky Wildcats. As the Tar Heels, who won their last five, Yorktown, Virginia is the young man's hometown. Kicking to Hill and Brooks. Kentucky fans on the near side of the field. North Carolina fans on mass on the far side of the field. A lot of partisan behavior from the crowd today. Out comes Chris Hill, sophomore from Montgomery, Alabama, and he is hit and brought down. Derek Ramsey, number 12, a junior from Camden, New Jersey. The backfield on the wishbone, Rod Stewart, 32. Greg Woods, 2. Randy Brooks, 45. On first down, some good bakery, and the play went right up the middle for Kentucky. Ball is on the 25-yard line. And coming through is the right halfback, Greg Woods. And he appears to have the first down. They're a running ball club. With the ball just shy of the 30. First down. And here is 22, Chris Hill. And he is driven back. Second down and five. As it turned out, he did gain five yards on the play. Ronnie Johnson was the man that made that tackle. Derek Ramsey. Now he looks to throw. Slips the tackle. Still on his feet. Brought down at the 21-yard line. 81, Bill Purdue. Good pressure by the Tar Heels. Third down and 17 now. And a third and 17, it's Ulysses Bun Reims on the punt return. And the punter is Pete Gemmel, a senior from Atlanta, Georgia. Fair catch called for back at the 46-yard line. Tail. The quarterback is Matt Kupek, number 12. The running backs are Billy Johnson, 36, the fullback. Larry Tedder, 32, the tailback. For the injured all-league performer, Mike Boyd. Going to try a run for a very short game. First possession here, Billy Johnson got the carry. They got four yards on that play, so it'll be second down and six at midfield for the Tar Heels. Rouse is in at wide receiver and plays the lead for North Carolina. Play action, Kupak throwing long. Intercepted, overthrown. Overthrown, intended for the wingback, Mel Collins. One of their two losses on the season, and they came back from those two midseason defeats. Third down and six. Bingo! Kupak throwing long again. Got him! Have to watch the official offsides, would you believe? Oh. How would you like to be the guy on the line that committed that error? It is still scoreless, but it is now third down and 11 with the ball in the 45 of North Carolina. They elect to run it. No, wait a minute. A fake, and the play goes the other way, out to the right. And it's Mel Collins, the wingback. And now it's fourth down and one. North Carolina going for it on fourth and one. Did Kentucky hold? Let's see. There you saw Jerry Blanton, the middle guard, number 92. North Carolina coaching staff, head coach Bill Dooley, been there 10 years, been in five bowl games. Straight ahead is Billy Johnson, the fullback. He fumbled the ball, and Kentucky recovers. It was Rick Hayden in there, and the rest of the Wildcats. First down, Kentucky. At Kentucky could go nowhere earlier on its first series. Now the Wildcats just go to their own 40. Running out of the full house, the wishbone. Up comes Rod Stewart, met by a gang of tacklers. Met by D. Hardis in 71, along with Simmons and Rain. And now, a little rough stop. Oh, D. Hardison, and D. Hardison keeps driving him back. Stewart doesn't like it. Hardison still pushing him back, and right there, Rod Stewart throwing the ball at him. And that's going to be a personal foul, a penalty against the Kentucky Wildcats. Second down and 23 at the 26-yard line for Kentucky. Vinion is on into the field, so far fumble. But the quarterback, Derek Ramsey, held out of that ball. Third down and 23 for Kentucky. Game scoreless first quarter, Beach Bowl, Atlanta, Georgia. First in up the middle is Rod Stewart, but he's going to be way short of that first down. And Kentucky will have to punt. Man is Mel Collins of Fairfax, Virginia. Collins comes up and tumbles on the ball over the 35-yard line. And here we go with the Tar Heels. They've got a man up on the wing there. And up to for North Carolina, 32, Larry Tedder, meeting stiff resistance. Excuse me. Running out of the eye formation. 
Matt Kubek, the quarterback, gives to the eye man, Larry Tedder, and he is stopped. Kentucky tough on defense. Collins on the wing, just behind the line of scrimmage. Third down and six. Passing down for Kubek. And he throws low at midfield, and now North Carolina. Willem, a junior of Charlotte, is averaging 38 and two-tenths yards a kick this season. Oh, boy. And it's a high this. boomer down to the 12. Wait a minute, it bounces inside the 10. Out of bounds. Three minutes and three seconds to play in the first quarter. Excuse me, 11, seven minutes and 35 seconds to play in the first quarter. Greg Woods, off the wishbone formation, runs it out for a first down. Nothing, nothing, if you just joined us, a 50-yard touchdown pass was washed out by an offside against North Carolina. Kentucky, Ramsey giving off to Chris Hill. Hill comes up the right side. Over First year for the wishbone offense at Kentucky. Lots of deception as Hill got the carry. Third down and three. Randy Brooks is in the left half, replacing Chris Hill. And the ball goes to Randy Brooks. First play he's been in there on, and he comes up to the 40-yard line. It appears he's short, however. Explosive return man. Pete Gemmel kicks. Oh, he can run this one back. Collins comes back to the 34. First down for North Carolina at the Carolina 34-yard line. And the pitch comes back to Doug Pascal, who was hit and dropped. Make it a gain of one. Second down and nine. Well, Dooley likes to use the seniors in there, and Tedder is uh, higher grade on the senior on the uh, North Carolina team. Good run there. There is Doug Pascal coming through. We'll see about North Carolina's depth at that tailback spot with the star of the ball club out today. Here's a keeper and drop is quarterback Matt Kupak. He's a little isolite. On fourth down, North Carolina kicking. It is a high kick. Sailing down to about the 25, and a fair catch there. Kentucky getting the reprieve there, and that penalty seemed to give Kentucky some life. Now Kentucky running out of the wishbone and looking for room is Chris Hill. Pretty good footwork as he comes out to about the 30. Second and fourth, the 31. Good look at quarterback Derek Ramsey, six feet five. Camden, New Jersey native. Ramsey giving a hill. Hill off the right side. Yes, it'll be third down. And a short three. Out about the 34-yard line. And the fullback, Rod Stewart of Lancaster, Ohio. Might have a fumble. And North Carolina recovers. Wait a minute. Let's watch the official now. Offside, North Carolina. Oh. No, not the Kentucky fans. Middle guard, Dave Simmons. He wants to go into broadcasting. <laughs> After his days at North Carolina, there's Chris Silly Hill boy. getting the carry. Second down and seven at about the 40 for Kentucky. Scoreless first period. Here's Hill trying to find room, dancing on the near side. All right, third down and five. Bear in mind, North Carolina had 17 interceptions during the regular season. Look at this protection. Ramsey gets it away and completed the pass to Woods. And Woods comes up, but he's going to be short of the first down. First quarter, but again, he is a dangerous punt return man. As Gemmel boots it, going to the far side. Collins watching it. Rolls dead, covered at about the 25 of North Carolina. Mark Cantrell is a super football player. He might go very high in the draft if there is one this year. First down at the 25 in the waning seconds of the first quarter, and it was Billy Johnson, the fullback. Right, that's the end of the first quarter. With the score, North Carolina, nothing, Kentucky, nothing. Let's return to our broadcasting studios for these messages. For North Carolina, Johnson's got 13, Pascal 8, and Tedder 5. As we're back live, we've had a lot of that today, Don. A lot of good defense. This is going to be a third down and one for North Carolina and the Kentucky defense. The Kentucky defense. We've had a number of kicks already. Sure has. In this ball game, as Elam punts it away. This is 44, Mike Sagonis of Norwalk, Connecticut. That get over the 50-yard line. Kentucky's made some big plays on defense already in this ballgame. Derek 
Ramsey. Throws it on the run, out of bounds. Flag on the play. And that's what we've got, intentional grounding. Kentucky back deep in its own territory. As Ramsey looking to run, he's a good runner. Over the 30, got about 13 yards on that play. Coming out to the 33-yard line. There's a little more people than a lot of kids from Virginia. Bill Dooley does a good job of recruiting. He brings youngsters in from all over. Second and eight now at about the 32. There's a close look at Doug Pasco. And again, they run the football, do the Tar Heel. Kupek from Syosset, New York, number 12, the quarterback. Kupek passing the football and hitting his man. It's Bill Mabry from Mount Airy, North Carolina, who made the catch. They're running a wide slot to the right. First and 10 on the 46-yard line of North Carolina. Doug Pascal on the pitch coming off the left side, getting up toward midfield. Tim Gooch from Hawesville, Kentucky. All right, second down and six. At about midfield, and there was Pascal stopped. But they've got their conference prize at stake, the Southeast Conference versus the Atlantic Coast Conference. Third down and six. Right up the middle for what appears to be a first down. Doug Pascal. North Carolina frequently has been in Kentucky territory, even though it's scoreless. And coming up to about the 40-yard line. Second down and seven from the 40-yard line of Kentucky. Running the wing formation, and here comes number 21, Mel Collins. He averaged about 11 yards of pickup this okay, year. Running from the line of scrimmage. Mike Corbin came in. Fleet Delbert Call at the top of your screen. Burning speed, but they run the football here. And Doug Banks, now the tailback, a freshman. Powell's in the game. He's Powell stays in. Receiver. Right. Thank you, Howard. Powell stays in. Fourth down and two. No gain. Billy Johnson stopped for no gain. And the ball goes over. Kentucky's offense comes on the field. And nine minutes to play in the second quarter. Kentucky has held North Carolina, and Kentucky now has the football. Just shy of the 35-yard line, first down. Rod Stewart. Pullback Rod Stewart. In the North Carolina territory for the Wildcats of Kentucky. Block is downfield. Good game. Now back live, it's Stewart again. Inside the 35. Gain about five on the play. Second down and two. Kentucky ball on the North Carolina 30-yard line. Nothing, nothing. Second quarter. This is Chris Hill to the far side. It appears he has that first down as he drives to the stake. Now the Wildcats have driven down the field. First and ten. Ramsey, big rush. Looking. Running. Hit. Fumbles ahead. From High Point, North Carolina. Second down and seven on the 25 of North Carolina. Greg Woods was stopped at the line of scrimmage. Third down play. On the 25-yard line, will Kentucky go to the air? No, they don't. They stay in the ground. And tumbling through is Stewart. He appears to be short. Fourth down and two for Kentucky. On the North Carolina 20 in the first half of a scoreless game. Look at that drive to the forward progress of Rod Stewart. Make it or not. Going to take a measurement. The Wildcats did convert. Kentucky with a drive having originated back at their own 30-yard line. Derek Ramsey calling the signals. It's the fullback, Rod Stewart, and he's met at the 15-yard line. Looking down and seven from the 15-yard line. Greg Woods busting down to the 11. Third down and three for Kentucky. Greg Woods again. First down, Kentucky. And about the six-yard line of North Carolina. The measurement shows that they're going to be short. There's the first down. Derek Ramsey got it right through the middle, right behind center Dave Hopewell. And they pick up the necessary yardage, and it is first and goal, Kentucky. A keep. Maybe a yard for Ramsey as he's driven back. Not high. Ramsey rolling right, cutting back. Stop. Stop. Billy rolls and tries to get 
Just more yardage, a great individual effort. Too much time. Well, some time, but now they're guilty of the infraction. No good. No good. And the game remains. Kentucky nothing. North Carolina nothing. Just has done the job on defense, and now they'll try to do the job on offense. It is second down. Kupak pitching back. Doug Banks comes up, and he's stopped by the defense. From the 13-yard line, third down and 17 for North Carolina. For Matt Kupak and company, as he gives to Doug Pascal, a freshman. And Pascal comes up to about the 20, but number. And here's the kick from Johnny Elam. The 46-yard line. It was Mike Sagonis, and it's good field position. They were two yards away a moment ago, and now they are 46 yards away on the Wildcats. Double wing setup now, it looks like. Ramsey throwing in front of his intended man. From the 46, second and 10, Kentucky. 35 seconds to play in the first half with the clock running. And the ball goes through the hands of linebacker Buddy Curry. Ready for the pass again. Third and 10. Kentucky actually would just like to get in a field goal position here. Long one downfield is overthrown intended for Trosper. Now it'll be fourth down. It was wide open. Kentucky kicking Pete Gummel. And the ball is down inside the five. But 13 seconds remain in this first half. Well, we have the third and fourth quarters to go. Could be an entirely different game in the second half. And a bit of a mishandle at the snap. Matt Kubek leading the way North Carolina Tar Heels into the locker room. And off go the Kentucky Wildcats <laughs> for a nothing-nothing game. It was quite a first half. That's the end of the second quarter of play with the score North Carolina nothing, Kentucky nothing. We'll be right back. North Carolina, they get their number one rusher out. They may go to the air. Kentucky's Joe Bryan kicking. Back in the end zone, Delbert Powell with lightning feet. And he made a pretty nice return coming over the 20-yard line. Now it is North Carolina in a scoreless Peach Bowl game. From about the 21-yard line of the Tar Heels. And fullback Billy Johnson of Buckingham, Virginia. Kentucky defense is a very tough defensive ball club to move against. One wide receiver beyond the top of the screen is Jim Rouse. And again, they run the football. And that was Johnson again. And I can't believe there were any yards left after Boyd gained over 1,400. Lee is wide to the right on third down and four. Kentucky recovers the football. Number 79, James Ramey. And the Wildcats have the football. It was Buddy Deal that created that fumble in the eastern part of the Bluegrass State. First down, Wildcats moving through the fullback, Rod Stewart, who had 69 yards at halftime. Procedure is the preliminary indication. Legal procedure is the call against the Wildcats. Kentucky does have a first down here. Derek Ramsey with Rod Stewart, Chris Hill, and Greg Woods behind him. Fake to Stewart. Ramsey. Got room. Ramsey. The ball pops loose. But it was fallen on by Randy Brooks. Okay. They gained six. It is second down and nine at the 19 of North Carolina. Nothing, nothing, third quarter. Whoa! And he got the ball away. D. Hardison came off. And we have a third and nine for Kentucky. Second time Kentucky's been deep in this game. Just before he said he gets it away. Chris Hill down to the five. Brings him down, but the Wildcats have a first and goal. At the five-yard line, right through the middle, fighting to get to that goal line. Ron Stewart. Ron Stewart down to about the one. Ordinarily on the offense, 97. Art still is in the game at tight end now for Kentucky. Second down and goal at the two. And the North Carolina defense stopping Hill. Well, the goal line unit for North Carolina will have to check that particular number. Third down and goal. Ramsey! He's short! Man, what defense. What unbelievable defense. Here we go. I guarantee you they won't take too much time this time. Touchdown, 
Kick is good. Let's take a look at it again. We're going to see the pullback. Rod Stewart, good blocking by Tom Dorbrook, the right guard. A lot of wedge up front. Warren Bryant, number 69, the All-American tackle. Good blocking by that Wildcat offensive line. All right, with a timeout on the field, the score is Kentucky 7 North Carolina nothing. Let's return for these brief messages. Kentucky's ahead, 7 nothing. Now here's the kickoff. Whoa, deep and out of the end zone. No run back for Delbert Powell. Lots of time remaining, just under 10 minutes to go in the third quarter. Let Mislu be the first to wish you Happy New Year. This handle of the backfield, covered at the 14-yard line by Doug Pascoe. North Carolina second and 15 from the 15 yard line. This is Matt Kupek. Going for Powell. Intercepted by Kentucky. Number 44, Mike Sagonis. And around midfield, Mike Sagonis, a New Englander from Norwalk, Connecticut. The ball's at midfield. Kentucky leading 7 0 with the ball. Quarterback Derek Ramsey faking to his fullback, Rod Stewart. Ramsey throwing for everything. Overthrown. Intended for Randy Burke, and I was just talking about Randy. Second down, 10 for Kentucky at midfield. Kentucky leading 7-0. Less than nine minutes to play in the third quarter. Ramsey throwing drop. It was dropped by 93, the tight end, Dave Prosper. Third down and 10. Kentucky got the ball on an interception, but Wildcats have yet to move it on this series. And it's the quarterback. He got down to about the 45-yard line, Derek Ramsey. He's in the game. Pretty good rush. He shanked that one. Hit it off the side of his foot. Right. Let's go now with North Carolina in possession at the 26. And the Kentucky defense doing the jobs. Kentucky recruiting the ball players, as is North Carolina. Second down and nine. Up the right side for about three to get yourself in a situation where you've got second and long yardage. You've got to pick up four or five a crack. Walker Lee wide left. The pitch goes to Pasco. Wildcats close in on the far side. All right, watch the guy that's going to anticipate this punt return now, Saganos, who does not like the fair catch. Johnny Elam punting. Saganos dropped the ball. And it looks as if North Carolina recovered. You called it hard. On the 25-yard line. It was right into his hands. North Carolina has the ball. First down from the 25-yard line. The ball pops loose, or did it? Well, Jaffe comes out at middle guard, replaced by another defensive back, Ray Carr, number 35. Second down and nine. Give him a yard pickup on that play. They come to the right. It is Larry Tedder and that Kentucky defense. Big play for North Carolina. Third down and fourth, the Kentucky 20. The play. Oh. The ball was thrown to Billy Johnson the foot. No, wait a minute. Now they rule incomplete. That's what they need for the first down, as you see the yard marker on the far side. Intercepted. No, incomplete. 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 Now Kentucky back in action. Randy Burke wide to the left. First down, Kentucky at the 20. Coming up there is Rod Stewart. Been the top runner in the football. Four minutes, 26 seconds to play in the third quarter. Kentucky leading. Number two, Greg Woods. Busting up the right side. Trying to get that first down as he crossed the 30. He did pick up the first down. Dave Hopewell, the center, through the good block. Now, picking off bodies is Chris Hill, who got a lot of action early. In the Second down and six at the Kentucky 36. Kentucky in white, leading North Carolina in dark. 7-0. Third quarter of the Peach Bowl game. And a gain of maybe a yard there. Number 12, six feet five. will have a good view of the secondary. He's going to pass the football. And he runs left on the option. Keeping and Kentucky will have to kick. Bill Perdue making the stop. There. And the putter, Pete Gemmel, senior from Atlanta for Kentucky. Man, look at Moving this. that kick. Hitting just at the nine. Going into the end zone. 
and North Carolina. And we have two minutes, 22 seconds to play in the third quarter. This team, North Carolina, trailing 7 nothing with the ball on the 20-yard line. And North Carolina trying to run it. Second and eight for North Carolina. Out of the wing formation now. Matt Kupek throws a wobbler. It was dropped by Lee. Had his hands out onto the sideline. With only a minute and 46 remaining in the third quarter. And the Wildcats leading these Tar Heels 7-0. On a possession play, they elect to keep it on the ground. No pass there. Points means the last month. Watching Johnny Elam. Now they call the fair catch. No. But the other man called the fair okay, catch at 44. Good field position for Kentucky at the 42. Wildcats and that fullback, big number 12, Derek Ramsey. There's Doug Pascoe. Tailback for North Carolina. Second and four, Kentucky. And they move it. Number 22, Chris Hill into North Carolina territory. They want to keep that lead and maybe put another marker on the board here in the third quarter with only five seconds left. And out wide left is Randy Burke. To give us to Randy Brooks. That's the end of the third quarter. With the score, Kentucky 7, North Carolina nothing. Let's pause right here. With Ms. Lou, and uh, we enjoy the association with both of these schools and their followers. Now it is Kentucky working the ball from North Carolina territory, pounding down to about the 30-yard line. Second down and seven for Kentucky. Kentucky leading 7 nothing. just the start of the fourth quarter in the Peach Bowl game. A highly emotional football game as Chris Hill goes out of bounds on the near side. Watching Derek Ramsey does a good job of directing this Kentucky offense. Randy Brooks to the near side. Close. Trying to get to the first down yardage. Randy Brooks is very close to getting that. He is a little short. Another fourth down play coming here. When Clark Gable marched in here for, you know, during Gone with the Wind, I'll tell you. <laughs> fourth down and inches. Got it. Kentucky getting the first down of the North Carolina 20-yard line as the bread and butter man from Lancaster, Ohio. Now let's go back the live. Oh, the 20 yard line. And the Wildcats ramming the ball down deep in now. What a Rod Stewart. The up man there in the backfield alignment for Kentucky, closing in on 100 yards rushing today. Still early in the fourth quarter. And he gets the ball again. Big first. Touchdown for Rod Stewart. And Kentucky is now two touchdowns ahead. Again, Don Perkins, it was Dave Hopewell that opened up that hole. Taking out the nose guard, Dave Simmons, the middle guard for the North Carolina Tar Heels. 57 yards for that score. John Pierce's extra point try is good. And Kentucky is out on top by two touchdowns. It's 14 to nothing. Take a look at that last touchdown run by Rod Stewart, getting a great block from the center, Dave oh. Hopewell. Right there. Right there's a good block on Buddy Curry from North Carolina. And there you see Rod Stewart, high knee action. He's determined to go in. Allen Caldwell gives a good chase, but he cannot be denied. Rod Stewart in standing up.